And now at five, it was two years ago, America lost one of its most beloved actors when Robin Williams tragically committed suicide. While many people believed he was severely depressed, his widow now reveals it was actually an unusual type of dementia that he suffered from. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez is here to explain. Yeah, that's right, guys. You know, when most people think of dementia, they think Alzheimer's, but there are other dementias, and Williams suffered with a type called Lewy body disease. Appearing on CBS this morning today, Susan Schneider Williams revealed the diagnosis diagnosis that explained the seemingly unconnected symptoms that led to her husband's suicide. Good morning, Vietnam! He was one of the most talented performers we have ever known, with an amazing range from slapstick comedy to moving dramatic roles. Do you think I know the first thing about how hard your life has been? But it was in real life where Williams was privately waging a desperate struggle against a brain disease he never knew he had and was only diagnosed after his death. I can tell you that in his autopsy, the coroner's report was clear that he had Lewy bodies throughout all of his brain and brain stem. Dr. Sam Gandhi is an expert in neurodegenerative diseases. He says Lewy body dementia affects almost one and a half million Americans. A particular substance called Lewy bodies that build up in the cortex and they are the cause of the disease. Clumps of protein that cause slow degeneration of the brain, a dementia, loss of the ability to think. In an editorial for the journal Neurology titled The Terrorist Inside My Husband's Brain, Susan Schneider Williams describes Robin's final year of life. She writes about his battle with the Lewy body disease, which she says drove Robin Williams to suicide. She writes, quote, it felt like he was drowning in his symptoms and I was drowning along with him. Because Lewy body disease can resemble Alzheimer's and even Parkinson's, doctors often prescribe medications for those illnesses. But the typical medications for Alzheimer's and Parkinson's can make Lewy body disease worse. Williams did have bad reactions to medications, as well as another hallmark of the disease. His fear and anxiety spiked and sustained at a level that was, was very scary. So that was kind of the beginning, really, the way I see it. Now, his widow says neither she nor anyone on his entire medical team suspected that Robin Williams was in danger of taking his own life. She says he was probably hiding the depth of his pain and frustration with his brain deterioration, hiding it from them and even from himself. And there is no treatment and no cure for Lewy body dementia at this point. And most people don't even realize it's so disturbing. Exactly. It really is. Wow. Dr. Max, thank you. you All right. Up next here. At